We ready to go? Oh yeah, we are raring to go. Okay. Well, I don't know, Marvie. Last time you forgot some things. Should we go over the list? Oh, Margie, I love it when we go through one of your lists, don't you know? <laughs> All right. Uh, quotes. Uh, yep. Hats. Yep. Change of clothes. Oh, you darn tootin'. Bolts. Uh, mm -hmm. there they are. Masks. So many masks. <laughs> zip ties. So many zip ties. Flagpole. Mm-hmm. But did you get the one with the sharpened metal ends? Oh, of course I did, hon. Uh, baseball bats. Oh, yeah. I even got that tiny little one that you could tuck into your purse that you like so much. Oh, I love you, Marvie. You're the best. Hush. Okay, now where did I leave off? Oh, oh, pepper spray. Oh, no. <gasps> Just joshing. <laughs> I got pepper spray and beer spray. Oh, oh, <laughs> you got me there. Yeah, I did. Well, uh, pepper spray, uh, bear spray was next on the list. So, stun gun? Yep. Okay, handguns, shotguns, rifles, and machine guns. Yep, 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 and yippers. <laughs> Gas detonators and all the other stuff you need to make. Oh, jeez. Here's the thing. The fertilizer guy, he said he couldn't make it in time. So the only thing I have is just some stuff to make some Molotov cocktails. You know, that fertilizer company has not heard the last from me. I, I'm, I'm riled up. I am riled up. I am not giving him a good Yelp review. Calm down, Marvy. Calm down. It's okay. You don't have to get so riled up. Now, what did you put in the trailer then? Oh! I put that battering ram in for, that we made in couples woodworking class. Oh, goodness! I've been dying to try that out. Oh, yeah. I really hope that uh, the English stain, that uh, chestnut stain that we put on it holds up. Oh, yeah, I'm sure it will. Now, Margie, when we commit insurrection, we have to make sure that we do it in an orderly fashion, okay? We got to stay within the lines and the ropes and whatnot, okay. all right? Yep, we're just on a normal tourist visit to the capital, don't you know? You turn to. <laughs> Since you're new in town, we're gonna show you how to catch yourself a steed. Thank you, I really wanna ride a steed. My father said I should leave, but I just have to. That's why you're here, girl. Yeah, we got your bag. Now you see that one right over there? Doing easy. That's how you catch yourselves a steep. Whoa! She rubbed him just like that. Katie's a genius. She's practically been doing it her entire life. Oh no! I will never be able myself to catch a steel like that. Give it a try. What about this one? Oh no! That one will lead you right into the ridge of despair. You can tell by his mane. What's the ridge of despair? Imagine a narrow pathway of rocks towering thousands of miles in the air. Then imagine you've walked halfway across it. Oh no. And the only way out is to just keep moving forward. What about that one? Oh, that's a good one. Here, use this. Here's goes nothing. Ow, what the fuck? You can't just go throwing apples at people. Who do you think you are? Jesus, crazy ass woman. Sorry. Johnson, to count one of indictment number SAJ1216, which charges you with first degree murder, a class A felony. How do you plead? Your Honor, my client pleads not guilty by reason of demonic possession. You know, ever since we got these Jesus pieces, it's like all the problems of the world have just gone away. Yeah, it's because we've removed all the demons from our life. Yeah, watching Conjuring 3 and realizing the devil was actually inside me was the greatest thing that's ever happened. So much happier. Right? Yeah, yeah. But, but now we've got to help 
the public, Mark. We will. Help the public. We'll stand oh, here. Oh, God. A priest. Uh, well, actually, we're... we're Demon hunters or exorcists or something, whatever. Yeah. Well, you have to choose a species. Yeah, and that's all that matters. Because we could be really fighting about the election. Yeah. I think this mail-in voting scandal that I learned about from the MyPillow guy on Tucker needs to be fixed with laws and regulations. And I think Trump is an idiot and he's so fake and we need AOC to save us. Don't worry. Just hold still. Demons! Be gone! All elections from past and present are free and fair. There's no reason to ever question anything ever again. Yeah. Thank no you. questions. No, thank you. Have a good day. Have a good day. Good day. Oh, that was, you do that in hunt. Yeah, right. That's good. Free. Oh, well, actually, we're, you know, uh, more, more demon hunters, right? Yeah, great, whatever. He, he's trying to take my gun away because he saw some guy kill his girlfriend in a big lots or something. I love my guns. And I'm definitely afraid that she's going to kill me, so. Hold still. Okay. Demons! Be gone! There. Did it work? There's no more gun violence. Perfect. Well, well, except for um, the police, Call of Duty, and, and the occasional rap video. Yeah. Oh, perfect. Oh, great. Thanks. Thank you. Have a great one. Bye. Bye. Two for two, right? Two for two. Right. Oh, good. We're doing good. Good, good. A priest. Uh, yep, Actually, yep. That is what we, we, are... Are... we are priests. Yep. Wait. So, do you guys perform miracles? Uh, we we rid the world of demons. Yeah, sort of like demon hunters, but only for Warner Brothers. <laughs> well, I wish you guys would have warned a brother earlier. I had a demon that threw an apple at my head. But that's beside the point. Honestly, there's this guy over there saying a lot of racist shit, and I was hoping you guys could fix it. Don't worry. Just hold still. Demons. Be gone! There. There is no more racism in the world. Wait, did you guys just try to cure racism? Uh, we should go? Yeah, yeah, we got a, got a baby to save. There's a K guy somewhere. Yeah. We gotta kill him. Yeah, you know that the church! The church! Bye! But what about the racist... Welcome to the show and let's play What Incentives Made You Get Vaccinated? I'm Mike with the mic and I'll be your host. And you may be wondering, what made me get vaccinated? <laughs> well, simply put, this fresh air and free beer from good old Papa Biden. If they can't pay my student loans, they better buy me a beer, damn it. Anyway, let's get right into it. We're gonna meet our lovely contestants. Over to the right, we have Miss Tiffany. Right in the middle, we have the powerful Will. And over to the left, we have Miss Maria, we're going to start with you. What made you get vaccinated? Well, uh, first a little bit about myself. I have two kids. My husband and I both work full-time jobs, and I enjoy my sweet snacks. Oh, isn't she so sweet? All right. Tiffany, what's your guess? Um, well, I think I'm going to have to go with free child care from various daycares. Mmm, that's very necessary. Yeah, it's trust me. Trust me, I have three kids, I know. All right, Will, what's your guess? Well, she held on for long enough, so I think she works for a company giving paid time for workers to get vaccinated. So I'm gonna go with paid time. Whoa! Yeah. Trying to take us to the bank with that answer. Oh, yeah. All right, Maria, the world wants to know. <laughs> well, the collective incentives were great, but I got most excited by the free donut from Krispy Kreme. I went right after alone and had an amazing time by myself. Look, the light was even on, so it was fresh. Mmm, I can taste that donut right now. Jesus Christ. All right, Will, you're up next, buddy. What made you get vaccinated? Well, I'm single. Uh, I work part-time at Amazon Warehouse, and I also got a hit podcast called The Will to Live. Interesting. Okay. Hardworking, ambitious, yet an entrepreneur. I love it. Maria, what's your guess? Well, he mentioned the Amazon thing, so I'm going to go with the $80 that uh, Amazon gave to their employees. $80? Jeez, can I get vaccinated again? I'm not getting paid nothing over here. All right, Tiffany, what's your guess? Well, I was originally with this guy, and then I decided to go with something a little more out of the box, like the chance to enter and win Super Bowl tickets or Daytona 500 tickets. I don't know, something sporty. Ooh, nice, nice guess. All right, are we going to make it rain with $80, or are we going to score a touchdown with Super Bowl tickets? Will, the world Well, there isn't anything that would get me to get that shot. Um, first off, I talk about it heavily on my podcast. Whoa, whoa, and, whoa, um, whoa, 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 you threw us for a curveball there. <laughs> I wish oh, you didn't sorry. speak into my mic. Hey, hey, this is my show, remember that. All right, so, Tiffany, 
bring us home. Well, I'm an activist. I love traveling and don't even think about talking to me before I've had my coffee. <laughs> <laughs> we won't. All right, Will, what made you think Tiffany got that? Well, I heard Spotify was having something, so probably that. She does seem like a music fest type of girl. Okay, spotty answer, but we'll take it. Maria? Okay, well, she does seem like a fun gal, so I was thinking something along the lines of dating apps, like Bumble. I hear they're doing some stuff. Oh, interesting. Let's see if we got a match here. Tiffany, over to you. Well, actually, I didn't need an incentive. I pretty much got it as soon as it was available for I could do the rest of my part for society. AKA a superiority complex. I love it. Well, at the end of the day, I think everyone should go out and get vaccinated. No one really wins this game here. Uh, if you are swiping right on Bumble, if you're getting Krispy Kreme donuts or even starting your own podcast, Hell, grab a beer, drink more responsibly than me, and we'll see you next pandemic. Goodbye. See you later. I am so glad we finally made it in Florida. Tell me about it. Traffic was terrible. Uh, my flight was terrible too. The kid behind me kept kicking my chair. Okay, well, children, uh, mom, next to me on the highway, takes her dirty diaper and throws it out the window it hits my windshield. Uh, that's nothing. The guy next to me opened a can of tuna mid-flight, except his hand slipped, and then he punched me in the eye. Okay, well, I had a tornado follow me from above over 10 exits. Lightning hit our plane, and we had to make an emergency landing. I ran out of gas, and I had to push my car. Uphill, both ways. Southwest? Stop serving alcohol to passengers. Oh, whoa, that's, that's definitely the winner. Yeah, would have been more fun if you were there. It sucks you're afraid of flying. I'm not afraid of flying. What? Why'd you drive? I haven't legally been able to fly since January 6th. Oh, don't look at me like that, you know this. What?